to mark invoices as paid on Pandal accounting software. So for example, if you look on your customers, and receivables, so there are outstanding amounts from your customers. And likewise, if you look from suppliers and payables report, there are outstanding amounts and overdue which need to be paid. But you know that you have already paid invoices as well as customers have paid to you. So how to mark these invoices as paid? You will need to go to banking, bank accounts. Okay, so click on blue button on the right hand side. I will choose today's date. To mark customer invoices as paid, you need to click on customer receipt, select customer, for example, Andrew Bush, click on invoices, and there is one invoice for um, eight pounds. Click pay in full, done. If you have multiple payments and you know all those dates, just amend date, for example, on 22nd, customer receipt, category, uh, let's say John, we'll check if John have, okay, John have and have bakery, click on invoices, and there's lots of invoices which are due for payment, so for example, uh, this invoice, this invoice, and let's say this invoice we have received amounts for, click done. It will in description show all invoices and will show total amount. Okay, click next plus. How to mark if you have paid invoices in the same way. For example, if you have paid on 22nd, select supplier payment, select supplier who you paid to, let's say green limited, Click on the green button invoices and select which invoices you have paid on 22nd March. So let's say I have paid these two invoices on 22nd March. Click done. It will show invoice numbers so you can check with your documents if needed. Click plus. For next entry, for example, yesterday I paid to supplier. Select supplier from your list, let's say Farmer Limited. Click on the green button invoices to select which invoice you paid. And for example, I paid these two invoices yesterday for Farmer Limited. And then today, add plus button. And today I paid supplier and let's say phone company. Click on the green button and let's say I paid this invoice. Click done. So once you are happy, with customer invoices, yeah, customer receipts, and with supplier receipts, click Save All. So now when we go to suppliers and look on suppliers payable report, these amounts have changed. And the same when you go to customers, Click View Receivables. It has been changed as well. So this is a way how you can mark invoices paid either from customers as money received from customers or as money paid to suppliers and locking out supplier invoices.